What is this interesting looking device? It is, uh, sorry, one second. Here we go. It is, in fact, a, uh, no idea. You, Ku, uh, Ant Holmes. I understand those words. <laughs> Don't get any of the instructions in here, so um, they're not going to be of much use. So it's kind of going to be a suck it and see kind of thing. I'm guessing I put ants in it. It does come with some uh, nice tweezers for me to forage for ants, but yes, essentially, our little ant pals go into this section. There we go. And it smells um, really similar to that stuff, that slime stuff you used to put in the top of your Ghostbusters house and watch it trickle down. So that's going to be uh, interesting to see them trickle down through the Ghostbusters house. We can put the ants in here and then they somehow, I don't know if you can see that, they can go through there. And then they can go through the hole down here. And then they pass through there, up here and into the Ghostbusters slime, which they can then eat. And uh, I can give them like, fruit and other insects and water in there. And then they can uh, live long and happy lives until they die with no queen or whatever. I don't know. But I guess um, I'm just going to sort of, uh, yeah, put some ants in and see where we get. Uh, yeah, I guess I'm going to go and find some ants now. Yeah. I don't think I'm going to get anywhere fast. I think it's probably best if I stick to the pavement and have a look for some uh, new ant pals. Yeah. No. Um, you're going to be my victims. I mean, uh, my guests. Okay. Off the lid. Uh, who should we go for first? I just. Where have you gone? Okay, you. I'm trying to film and do this is going to be difficult. No. In fact, I think I've just killed that one. Okay, not sure how this is going to work, if I can, no, no, oh, have I got, I think I've got one, oh, <laughs> there, there's two, two of them, brilliant, okay, I might try and put one in here as well, uh, if I can, there's a few down here, look, uh, no, uh. Ooh. They're all going in this hole. Come out. Uh, you. Oh, uh. There, he's gone in the. He's gone in the bit. So I can get one more. Oh, friend. Friend. Uh, come on. No, he's getting out now. Stay in there. Stay in there. Okay, fine. Fine, I will have three. You're trying to get out. You're running around. So, okay, there's three in there. I may try and build up supplies when they're not being running around sods. But, uh, yes. Let's, uh, let's see how we get on. I need to try and give these things some water, but this one won't leave this compartment. Go and see your friends, look. They're having a great time. This one's desperately trying to get out, but they, I'm sure they're probably loving it. There he goes, over the blue stuff. Tunnel through it, my little woodland friend. Is this one still gone? No, it's still there. Please leave so I can give you nourishment. Quick, while he's in the lower compartment. <laughs> Oh crap, that's not very much. I'll have to do for now. <laughs> right, there we go. Still uh, still just arsing around in there. 
and I expect tunnels any time now or I'm going to cause shenanigans on this thing. Ooh, this one's coming up through the middle. Yeah, look at him go. Go and join your friends. No, don't go back down. Bloody ant. I don't know if you can see that, but uh, the little fucker is getting out of the air hole. Which, yeah, that's not a sign of a good ant farm. If they can get out the air hole. So let's just linger on this for a moment and watch this little bastard try and escape. Seems to be doing a pretty good job. Okay, plugged it with a little bit of tissue, so I should still be able to breathe. It's not particularly tight, just heavy enough so that they can't push it out. They're kind of still just uh, mooching around in there. I really want them to go through the blue crap. Hurry up and go through the blue crap, please. I promise once this whole charade's over, I'll let you out. Okay, I'm going to have to stop watching because nothing's going to happen while I stand here and watch, like some sort of towering Goliath over the city of the Ant people. I don't even know what I'm talking about now. Just dig through the blue stuff. Notice something um, strange about the Ant Farm this morning? Notice anything that uh, may be slightly amiss? Well, uh, it's fucking empty, isn't it? So, last night, I noticed one of the little buggers was running about on the, uh, on the side. Somehow it had got out. So I thought, hmm, that's interesting. So I kind of tightened this up a little bit. Looked for where else they may be uh, getting out. And uh, I brought it outside because I didn't want all the ants running around if they all somehow found their way out. And uh, lo and behold, they have. They have all escaped. So there we go. Not, not a good thing. Actually, uh, to be fair to the product, or to at least um, say what I've discovered, uh, British ants are not suitable for this thing. Uh, and for some reason they don't tell you that when you buy it. You have to actually uh, import special ants that eat the blue shit. From what I've seen, uh, any ant can escape from this thing somehow because it's a mightily flawed product. So there we go. This is a complete waste of time, money and effort. And uh, yeah, I'm just super pissed off. Although I kind of do want to do this to it now, so... Yeah, that's really gross.